Hi, I'm Seglo Lawagido and you are watching Accelerate TV. I play Dami in The Olive. Make sure you watch, like, subscribe, tell everyone about it because it's amazing. <laughs>
is not just a book of history. It is a leader's blackmail. Everything about every single one of us is in that book. And in the wrong hands, it is a weapon. I have the book. Show me. I don't need to. Sooner than later, you will have to show the book. <laughs> because whoever has it, has the power. And if it is truly missing, as I know it is, hope I don't find it first. Where is the ledger? Or do you, do you think moving to Lagos and evading us was a wise move? Why would a leader need to evade his own organization? He's incompetent. Madam Elaine. What? Have I lied? Ibrahim. <clears throat> there are some things that I am certain of. One, you are a terrible leader. Two, oh, the ledger is missing. Three, if I find that ledger, before you do, <laughs> I will make sure that the El Hassans never lead us again. And I will not just stop at your leadership. I will take all your roots. I will take your networks. I will take everything. Because if you are too stupid to control this, then you deserve to lose everything. So, it's either you meet with us, or I give everyone the new address. After all, this place is big enough to host us all. got back to us yet. She hasn't. She says she checked the office and found nothing. But she said she, she didn't have enough time to check. The next time you go to pick up, tell the manager the girl is a part of us now. Yes, sir. And the next time Madame Elaine surprises me in my own home. Yes, sir. Now, wow. I'm glad you are civil. How can single Jones jam you wrong like that? Is Lego safe? <laughs> my sister. 
You better thank your God so you never die to wear like chicken. My sister, ah. now I can for the chop by now. <laughs> you hmm. know well. And you know, say, Berry Aka, it is sweet, pass <laughs> anything, but you know, if you don't stop down for the place. Angel! Solo? Solo, what you So you never die? You leave me for hours to the bubble AC for work, Abi? Solo, I beg. Just the go house, I'll come with you. Abi, they crazy. They mad. That mama no tell you I go break your head. What's happening here? Don't know. See the mama now. Mama, please, please somebody call you security. You not tell us I go kill him. Security, mama. Security for me. You know where I be. You tell that guy where we're in front of you, do me anything, Mama. Lock up. Angel, pack your things. Uh, what is so it? You know, see, they have to find work. You want to shame me for it? So, no. Let me go. go. Angelica. Oh, now everyone know that I'm with someone like that. And so, even if they know, no one knows what you have been through. So no one has any right to judge you. No one knows what's happening in their own lives. Oh, Angelica, you're not going to go back to him. So you're not going to be with someone like him. You're going to be with your new family, Mama Kicho. Okay? It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Yes, yes. Oh, they look really good. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Ndidi. Um, I appreciate this. Could you please just send me these designs? Because the launch is almost here. So I basically need that as soon as possible. Right? All right. Thank you. Thank you so much. Benzi. Hey. I'm <laughs> sorry for dropping in unannounced. No, no. No, it's fine. Please, please sit. This is what family does. We just drop by. <laughs> so, how's the launch coming along? Uh, it is coming. It is coming. Um, everything is going great. I'm grateful for that. You're going to be able to make it, right? Definitely. Just send me the details. Good, 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 good. Thanks a lot for letting me hang out with the kids the other day. That was so good. No, 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 no. There's nothing to thank me for. We're family, and we, we have to start acting that way. I mean, the kids need that, so yes. I agree. And that's why I want to ask you something. Okay, what? Now, I know you don't want a loan or any freebies from me. Um, so I thought we'd do business. Business? Mm -hmm. Now. Look, running a restaurant is tough business, and I know it's finance you love. Yes. So, how about you sell the restaurant to me? With the building and everything. Ah, uh, what? I mean, you could keep the staff, uh, keep everything else as it as is, but at least you'd have the funds. Look, <laughs> Benson, I appreciate everything you're doing to help, um, I, I, I do, but I can't sell this restaurant. I mean, it is, it is a part of Ehi that I'm not willing to let go of. I understand. Look, look, um, how much are you willing to, to, to help Adora? Very much. She's my niece. And I want the best for her. Good. So, you know what? Since you want to help Adora so much, and you've really been persistent, um, and I think, I, yes, I, I will just offer it. I'll just accept your offer to, to pay for her tuition. Really? Yes. Great! <laughs> this, this will make her happy. So thank you. Thank you so much. Wow. <laughs> Ah, oh, good morning, my son. Where are you going with your adopted mother? She's not my mom, she's my wife. 
Stop Shh. pointing at me. Dream on. Don't point at me. What will you do about Moses? Uh, if you are not contribute to this country, you are killing. We didn't agree to sell the restaurant. Did the girl find anything? I haven't asked her, sir. But I will tonight on the Peacock. Okay. Well, boss, have you thought of the fact that she hid it in their home? She wouldn't hide it there. It's too close to danger for her family. So, we need to tear the restaurant apart. Yes, we will. But only if the girl doesn't find it. So be prepared. Yes, boss. Yeah, me sit and tear the girl, my life be like yo. Come in. Well, looks to me like um, someone is having a good time. But Mr. Fluffy, really? Well, my father grounded me. I have to find a way to enjoy the rest of my holiday. <laughs> I saw what you're doing. You're trying to guilt me into reducing your sentence, young lady. Obviously. <laughs> But to be fair, you have done a great job of deputizing for to um, Angelica. So, I feel like you deserve some concessions so you can have a friend over. Oh, finally! <laughs> Come on, it's not that bad. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, Ada? Yeah? I wanted, I wanted to ask you something. Okay. What do you think of um, your attitude to? What do you mean? You know, um, as a person. Oh, um... Okay, I think she's a nice person. She is, she is. I think she's a good friend to you. Yeah. I was surprised to see her at the beach, though. Why are you asking? Um... Oh, my God. Do you want to call Uncle Benson? That's why you brought her, right? You know, I was thinking about that. Oh. I thought about it. Oh, she is a nice person. I'm sure you'll get along. <laughs> right. Um, speaking of your <laughs> Uncle Benson, he and I came to an agreement yesterday. About what? Well, about you and your school. Okay. And? And we've agreed that it's okay for him to help us. <laughs> Thank, <Okay. you. laughs> Thank you so much. Right. <laughs> right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. What, what, you're calling him already? No, I'm calling Shara. Tell her that I'm coming back to school. Hey, Shara. Yes. Okay, guess what? I'm coming back to school! <laughs> yes. I know. <laughs> Where's the girl? She's inside. Did you tell her what we're doing here? No. Call her for me. Why again? When you told me to make sure that she was here, I said, okay. Why does she have to be out here with us? Hasn't she suffered enough? Look at me. Learn not to ask me questions. Especially now that we can replace you. Is that clear? <laughs> Go and get her for me.
Did you find it? Did you search well? Yes, I... I did, but... I didn't have enough time and you, you, you told me... So, to... so you need time to search? Huh? Is it not that small office there? Huh? Yes, but... Mama! Hey, come, come. Stand here. And you... You will go back in there and make good use of your time. You know, you, you like asking questions. But that is how you didn't tell her what you do for us. Let me tell you. Don't ask her to tell you what she's doing for me. Because if you do, you won't like what would happen. Is that clear? Because you're going to get it though. Oh no, why can't you just get it? Do you want me to change the channel? Hey, Kitty. Can I help you? Is that right here? And if she is? Tell her her boyfriend is here to see her. Kosi, who is that? Your former boyfriend. What? Um, so, can I... Uh, hi. I've missed you. You look pretty. What are you doing here? I'm here to see you. Why? Uh, because you're my girlfriend and I miss you. I see. Right? Okay. What? Can you use this one? Yeah, so, um, rumor has it that you're coming back to school with us. Right? Where did you get that from? Uh, grapevine. <laughs> okay. So that's why you're here. To make sure our relationship is intact for school. Of course. I mean, you think I want to go back to school without a girlfriend? A girlfriend? Yeah, you. Or anyone else, really. Because when I wasn't going back to school, you were ready to replace me just like that. Oh, come on, come on, babe. I was not going to replace you. I was just saying I didn't want to do the long distance thing. Okay, but we were in Lagos together for summer. Why did you not wait? For when the long distance was a problem, babe, to actually break up babe, with me. Babe, babe, come on, babe. All that is in the past right now. Okay. Can we just focus on the future and on getting back to regular programming? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. No problem. Okay. Yeah. So regular programming is that uh -huh. we're done. You're actually not worth my time. I can't believe I was even so shallow to be with you in the first place. So if you don't mind, David, that's the door. <laughs> Babe, really? You're, you're breaking up with me? <laughs> yeah, looks like it. Are you kidding me? No one breaks up with David Ayodele. Well, she just did. <laughs> Let me sit and see the girl, my life be like you. No, we look in a year, they bark out, they ain't looking a year for you. Did you see me? Let's go, Emma. So, the third of the four, for the man, you are this yard, this. Don't be your bother, Nero. Why are we not at your restaurant again? Because privacy. Privacy. Mm -hmm. In a coffee shop. <laughs> <laughs> or you're just hiding me from a door. Well, I just figured that it was a better idea for us to do this in public eye. Hmm. Yeah. So where does she think you are right now? 
Actually, I um, I told Adora that I was auditioning you for <clears throat> for Benson. Okay, I understand. Well, how will they feel when they find out the truth? Honestly, I don't know. But what I do know is that I enjoy your company a lot. And that I'm still very much in love with my wife. Okay. What is the truth? <laughs> and I, uh, we both know what the truth is. How do I begin, begin to say my mind, oh, damn and don't cry. I, I should be running away. I, I feel so different these days. Everything's falling apart. I know I'm dying inside. You were devoted, oh, oh yes I noticed, but some truths keep coming back again. I wanna move on. I'm stuck here with the issues that I. Can I be? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You were devoted. 